Manchester United are in the market for a new number one, with Inter's Andre Onana the favourite for the position. Having already worked with the player at Ajax, Ten Hag seems eager to bring his former goalkeeper to Old Trafford. So here's a very quick breakdown of what Andre Onana would bring to United. Onana has a serious case for having the best distribution of any goalkeeper in world football. His passing range is exceptional. You can pretty much name any type of pass and the Interman has it in his locker. Whether that be a short pass, direct pass into the centre forward, clip passes to the fullback or line breaking passes. Onana is simply a master at outnumbering an opposition press and he likes to use this to full effect, often leaving his area and playing amongst the defenders, acting as an additional outfield player and helping his side to advance into the opposition half. Pep Guardiola even said, It's difficult when you have that keeper to press high properly. For the way he plays, Onana is an exceptional goalkeeper. He takes the position in build-up really, really good. And we then went on to see Onana replicate just that in the Champions League final, cutting Manchester City's structure apart with his passing and impressing despite the result. The goalkeeper's composure in possession is one of his standout traits. When pressed, he's more than capable of evading the opposition before starting an attack. And when the opposition choose to sit off, as most sides do, the goalkeeper has the ability to carve through the defensive lines with his passing, which is a skill set that Eric Ten Hag will be more than grateful to have in his side. Onto the goalkeeper's shot stopping, and it's safe to say that Onana is more than strong in this area. When looking into the numbers, in the majority of seasons, Onana has prevented an incredible amount of goals, with only the occasional underperformance. His shot stopping is far stronger than the likes of Diogo Costa. He has excellent reflexes, good starting positions and very good mobility to move across his goal, which allows him to react to shots much faster. Don't get me wrong though, he's still prone to conceding goals that would be considered savable, as does every goalkeeper. And he does have a slight weakness at saving shots placed highly to his right hand side. But what really helps Onana in this regard is his proactivity. Preventing shots before they occur and regaining possession for his side. His shot prevention is incredibly strong, even if he hasn't been able to demonstrate it at Inter. If you were to pull up the FB ref of Onana, you'd be forgiven for thinking that he struggles in terms of commanding his area and sweeping. Ranking fairly poorly in these metrics from the last season. But this is not down to an issue of ability and instead is because of the system that he plays in at Inter, who face an exceptionally low amount of crosses and also play an incredibly deep defensive line, which will obviously have an effect on the numbers produced by Onana in terms of stopping crosses and sweeping. A better way to judge the player is by looking back at his Ajax days, where he played behind a high defensive line and faced far more crosses, and it came as no surprise to see that Onana ranked much better in this period, as the system plays to his strengths, allowing him to sweep up and command his area when called upon. I will say that Onana occasionally will misjudge a sweep, which could very easily result in conceding, but there's no denying that the goalkeeper is a net positive, and definitely gets far more right than he does wrong. But that's a complete breakdown of what Andre Onana would bring to Ten Hag's side. A player who knows the system, the coach, and a few of his potential teammates already. So you'd imagine that Onana would transition into this United side a lot easier than other candidates. The positive impacts of signing Onana will elevate Ten Hag's team tenfold. Not to mention the ripple effect that it will have on the rest of the team. Such as raising the height of the defensive line. Which itself will also bring even more benefits. With a rumoured price of around £42 million, and United beginning to step up the pursuit of the goalkeeper, would you bring Andre Onana in this summer? As always, let me know in the comments.